एवरीवन वेलकम बैक क्राउन गी केयर सो द इंटरनेट डाउनलोड मैनेजर आईडीएम इज वन ऑफ द बेस्ट एंड द मोस्ट पॉपुलर डाउनलोड मैनेजर फॉर विंडोज बट सैडली इट कम्स ओनली विद द थर्टी डे ट्रायल नाउ एंड आफ्टर दैट यू नीड टू बाय अ लाइसेंस टू कंटिन्यू नाउ आई ऑल्सो अंडरस्टैंड दैट मोस्ट ऑफ यू नीड सच काइंड ऑफ गुड डाउनलोड मैनेजर फॉर फास्टर डाउनलोडिंग एंड फॉर एब्सोल्यूटली फ्री and so i'm sharing one of the best free download manager which is the best alternative of idm and you can really enjoy the features like idm with this download manager all right so i'm talking about ab download manager which is one of the best alternative of idm and it's absolutely safe and free let me show you if i copy their website and go to the virus total and paste their url and hit the enter key so you will find it says no security vendor flag this url as malicious so it's absolutely neat and clean the website is safe the tool is safe and i already found many videos on the youtube talking about this download manager so i downloaded it tested it and found that that this is the one of the best option for the idm all right so once you come up here you will have to click on get app here and if you want to read more about it that how exactly it work and if you want to have a preview about it you can preview it you can see their feature simple and modern ui faster download speed download queue browser integration speed limiter download scheduler all the facilities all the features are been provided okay so click on get app now it says choose a platform you can go with the linux you can also go with the windows so i will go with the windows here so i will click on direct download exe or you can also go with the zip option as of now i will go with the exe so i will click on it and the downloading will be quickly started now you can even download the extension depending on your browser if you are using the firefox or google chrome you can download for both of them i will do that and show you that as well don't worry okay so the file has been finally downloaded and i will click on it then you will be getting this kind of setup page click on next next uh keep this all the option checked click on install and the installation will be started it won't take much time and once it will be done it says installation complete so you will have to click on next and click on finish all right so this is how the ab downloader manager dashboard looks like and let me show you uh, explain some of their feature so that you can better understand so from the left and top menu option if i click on file and click on new download so you can start any downloading from here only by pasting the url of that particular download you can also import from the clipboard you can also do the batch download then you have the task option you can start the queue you can delete any kind of files in the tool section you get the download browser integration so let's say if i want to download the extension for the google chrome also because i personally use the google chrome but if you use mozilla then you can also go with that and if i click on it the extension page will be up here and then i have to click on add to chrome click on add extension and the extension will now be added here all right click on the puzzle icon on the browser and make sure that you pin this extension so that it should be displayed over here okay now let's come back to the dashboard again and then if i click on tool then you have the setting option and if i click on it so in the appearance you can just make it to dark or light whichever you prefer language you can change your language here to start on boot Uh, personally i want to recommend you doing this because keeping the application while the startup that basically slow down the performance whenever you need it i would prefer you to manually open it notification sound yes you can keep this enable download engine uh if you want to use any kind of proxy then you also have this option over here show average speed global speed limiter thread count if you want to increase or decrease it then you can do that dynamic part creation make sure it's been enabled should download program dialog enable it all right so these are the options that you can check here browser integration again if you want to disable any time you can disable it or if you want to change the port you can change it the one thing again i would like to show you here you will not be getting any option to activate it because it's for absolutely free there is not any kind of limitation you can download the larger file and there is not any trial period as well okay and you can check here if i go to any of the options here there is nothing popping up that you have to go ahead and activate it all right now let's see how exactly it work so if i bring up 
any uh, let's download the Windows 11 ISO and see that how exactly it work. All right, so I have come to the download page here. Now, generally what happened whenever you have to download any file, you click on 64 bit download or the download button. Now, if you make a right click on the download button, you will be getting a new option here. Download with ABDM. Okay, your down new download manager will be automatically displayed here. And if I click on it, so you will find that the URL will be automatically detected. And if I click on download, and you will find that the downloading speed will be much faster as compared to the regular downloading. Okay, so that's all guys for today. And hopefully you will enjoy and love this download manager, which is for absolutely free and the best alternative to IDM. And if you really found this useful and helpful, please let me know in the comment section and do not forget to like and subscribe. And I see you in the next video. Bye-bye.